Hey guys, Blue Blonde, back. I'm Aaron. I'm Calvin. Rick. Eric. And we are here with a trailer uh, that we're going to be reacting to for the franchise that we've all seen some of. Yes. Right? Everyone has seen a little I bit of Alien? I think I've seen the least. We did a commentary yeah. of mm -hmm. at least one of them. At least the first, them. The first at least one. At least Alien. So of uh, Alien. This is for Romulus. Uh, whatever that means. the rest of your life. You know I don't. Then this is our only ticket out of here. Oh, that is gorgeous. Yeah. This uh, looks really cool. Ooh. Yes. Into Ridley Scott. Oh no. Oh my gosh, can you see through the Oh that's so cool. That's what the noise was? Yeah. Horrifying. That's oh, great. That's... What's happening? Whoa. They swim now. Get it right away, either. <laughs> oh, so cool. That's really cool. No shit. Are you sure you want to do this? I love the little head that comes out. <laughs> uh, so Romulus is the ship. Yeah, probably. And it's alien Romulus. Mm. I I haven't seen many of these movies. Mm. I think they're cool. But that was a great trailer. It was really good. I really enjoyed that. I loved the the feedback while she's screaming thing. I, well, I hated it. I hated the sound, but it was very effective. Sure. I know what you mean. I don't think you're meant to enjoy it. No. Still probably the best tagline of movies. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I know. They don't Space go all the way out and say it, but, but they get there, you know? Yeah. Uh -huh. And then the, 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 the alien. I love it. They did that, too. Yep. I love that logo. Also, like, I thought it was interesting they had a face hugger, like, jump on a guy, but, like, you're seeing it not, like, usually it just kind of, like, it goes. Yeah. Or yeah. it cuts away. This is like, it didn't quite get him the first time. It's struggling to still get him there. I'm like, man, that's even worse, I what feel do, what like. What do you do? Just close your mouth. Eat my way out of this situation. I mean, it's you designed can't bite it. to... I'm going to bite it. You can't bite it. I wanted it to it's die. It's acid blood. I want it dead. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to bite it. I want like a cage over my head, like Darth Bane. Old Darth Bane in the Legends. He had a giant cage over his head. Protect him from the ground. So that his stuff. armor wouldn't grow over his face. <sighs> yeah. You think uh, you got cavities now? Bite an alien, find out. <laughs> a lot of the visuals are really good. I love like when you're watching, you're like, oh man, there's a hole all the way through. And it's like, oh, that's the blood. Yeah. You know, that's really yeah. cool. And the, like, it spends so much of the time in the trailer in the beginning, like, and it's getting like a little bit more, a little bit more, and then it ends it with like the, the chest burster. Yeah. But they're like showing it through the body. Yeah. yeah. It has like that, when you like, show a flashlight through your hand. That's it's like, cool. yeah, it's like a, it's like an old video co pilot like effect. That they used to do for like demon faces or whatever to create like a skull in there so that when light is shining through you can see your skull. Mm -hmm. But that was like a rib cage. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. It's like uh, they use like transluminators and stuff like that. They shine light into the skin so that you can see the veins so that you can start an IV easier. Mm -hmm. But it's like a whole body yeah. transluminator. Yeah. It's really cool. I hope the movie does really well uh, and like is like a good movie. I feel like the Alien franchise like eventually started to kind of fall off. AVP didn't really do great. Um, I know some people that have liked Prometheus and Covenant. Um, I know some people that don't like Prometheus mm -hmm. and Covenant. So I saw like, Prometheus. I remember watching that. Did one. you? Yeah. yeah. So, like, those ones there, like, they're trying to go back before, but I know a lot of people just... I know a lot of people that didn't enjoy the, mm. the story that they were telling with that. Covenant's the only one I haven't seen. Yeah. Mm. I've, seen, I've seen... I think the only one I haven't seen is Alien 4. Uh, Resurrection. Resurrection. 
That's the only one I haven't seen. I don't um, think I've seen Resurrection also, but I think, I think but, I've seen all the others. I enjoyed the like the ship sets of the trailer. I thought mm-hmm. that the aesthetic really nailed it for me in terms sure. of like thinking back on the old Alien movie. Well, a lot of things look very mm-hmm. similar to the older one. Mm-hmm. Them running by like the medical center is what it looked like at the one point, yeah. like the with the big window, mm-hmm. um, and just different points that that feels like in the Alien. So I, I wonder if this is like close to the same like time in the in the story. Um, I don't remember what was the ship in the first movie. Do you remember it? Nostradamo. Yeah, that's or, right. Or Nostradamus. Yeah. So. Nostromo? Nostromo. Nostromo. That's that it. sounds right. Yeah. Yeah, the Nostromo. Because that, that's, I think the crash of that's in Dead by Daylight as well. But, uh... I don't, I don't know that trivia. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so I wonder yeah, if, like... Ezra was the ship in Matrix. Yeah, that's true. <clears throat> but, like, Romulus, like, I don't know if there's any going to be any connections to any of those kind of things. Mm-hmm. If it's going to be in a whole kind of different part. Or, mm-hmm. or if they connected to any of the previous storylines or anything. There would be like an empire. I don't know. A Roman Empire? Maybe. An alien empire. But I think it's an interesting director. Like I think Evil he, Dead. He, yeah, from Evil Dead, like he does horrific like violence very well. Yeah. Well, and then Don't Breathe does like the suspense mm-hmm. aspect really well too, right? Yeah. Which is some of the like some of the, the hallmarks. Of my, yeah, that's some of the best parts. I feel like, like those two things are like the homework for this. Yeah. So, like this is your final exam, <laughs> and then there's a lot of things that have kind of callbacks to it. Like you, you have that shot of the alien and them like you know doing this, which is just straight from the old movies mm-hmm. of Sigourney Weaver being like, yeah, yeah. It's like Predator, right? Where it's hard to recreate that first experience where it's scary because you don't know how it works. Sure. Mm-hmm. You don't know what it's capable of. I guess what I hope for then is that this <clears throat> works to bring in new audiences that have maybe never seen it. Where like lots of times people don't go back and watch some of the old movies, but when a new one comes out, they'll be like, "Oh, I'll check that out." Maybe that just sparks an interest for for some of that to getting into like the idea of the Alien franchise and stuff. Maybe and maybe bring in like a good Alien vs Predator. I'd like to see that. Prey was great. I really enjoyed Prey. Prey was, it was fun. really good. I liked it more than Predator. Predator. Predators. Yeah, the Adrian Brody one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I didn't love that one as much, but the, the the next one I didn't. I think I loved less. So I'd love to get Predator and Alien both kind of back into like a fun point and maybe get a good AVP thing going. Mm-hmm. That's not too dark to see and still rated R. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like that'd just be fun. It's true. Did this have a date? <clears throat> yeah, usually you would have put a date. August, August 16th. 16th. <gasps> yes. Only in theaters. Yes, Happy birthday to me. Almost. August 16th. Yeah. Well, I'm looking forward to getting back into the Alien franchise and I'm seeing intrigued. what they do now. Yeah. Me trailer was too. great. I hope the movie is good. Me too. Guys, thank you so much. If you enjoyed this and want to check out our Alien commentary that we did, which I also think was Eric's maybe first time watching it, mm-hmm. uh, you can find that right here on the channel. And if you'd like us to check out some more of the Alien franchise, some movies that Eric hasn't seen or maybe the ones that like uh, Calvin and I haven't seen, make sure you update your recommendations over at blindwave.com. Update your movies, update your shows, and let us know what you would like us to check out in the future.